full electric cars are in use at the municipal owned companies and institutions and our aim is to modernize the whole fleet. Further projects will be launched soon and within the framework of these projects, 10 new electric fueling stations will be built. Less than two years ago, the buses used in local public transport were replaced by new CNG-powered buses. The basis of the fuel used, thanks to a trilateral agreement, is produced indirectly by the local sugar factory. And our program still continues. By the end of this year, two new full electric buses will have been purchased. To achieve as substantial and effective a reduction as possible of the greenhouse gas emission, not only a bus fleet, but the whole of the community transport system has been modernized. Also, transport infrastructure will be expanded with the development of a new intermodal hub. Presently, the test run of the local public bike system is being conducted using four docking stations. Soon the station network will be expanded to 18 stations and according to plans, 170 electrically assisted bicycles will be available to the locals. In 2015, 2135 lamp bodies were replaced with LED lamps and an intelligent lighting control system was installed. The recultivation of landfills in Kaposvár was completed and natural biological habitats were created during the process. Selective waste is collected from households and home composting is also available. Particular emphasis is placed on public awareness raising programs appealing to all ages. We do realize that sustainability will not be achieved by providing renewable energy to meet the present excess demand. Therefore, our first and foremost task is to reduce our energy consumption. In previous years, the energy-efficient modernization of six buildings were carried out, and this year further projects have been launched to renovate an additional 11 buildings. Also, solar panel system will have been installed at 19 venues with a capacity of almost 900 kW. Through these new projects, our annual CO2 emission will be reduced by 2,000 tons. Our district heating system has been continually developed and expanded. The investments made so far resulted in the reduction of the annual CO2 emission by 2,600 tons. Presently, preparations are underway to expand the system and build a biomass heating plant. We are aware of the fact that large-scale developments are needed to achieve our objectives. Currently, we are working on reducing our energy consumption and creating opportunities for installing solar power plants in areas surrounding Kaposvár. In other words, we are planning to develop a smart grid system which would provide a safe and sustainable energy supply option for our city in the future. Thank you for your kind attention.